What's up, YouTube? Marvin Ford here with another Great American Survival. And if you're like me and you wondered who made the best fishing subscription box for July 2020, Monster Bass or Six Cents, then you should stick with us. I'll tell you all about it. This video is intended for all ages. Now this month, we're gonna be telling you the way it started off. Six cents sent us, just like it does always, it sends us this nice, they usually send smaller bags, but this month they sent us a monster. It is a giant sack. Uh, very nice, just like all these others, these little crushed, uh, they're a lot like a Crown Royal bag, and they're just great for bait and stuff like that. Uh, monster Bass this month is something a little different. This mon Monster Bass this month is taken over by Lunker Hunt. Now, Lunker Hunt makes some great products. So I think this month, having looked at both these boxes, this is probably the closest I've seen them come when they both hit up. And they both are actually on the same page, and they both, uh, both did a great job. Uh, but I'm going to crack them both open. We're going to start off with the Monster Bass box this month, and we are going to show you what they sent us. Now, just like the, uh, the Sixth Sense Premium box, this is the Monster Bass Regional Pro Box. Uh, for the southeast. I live in Georgia and this is the little breakdown. It shows you what you could get. You could get any of these items. Um, I didn't, I was kind of disappointed. I really like the Gambit. It's one of my favorites, but I didn't get one this month, but I own quite a few and it's one of my favorite swim baits. So let's start off. I'm going to show you what they sent us and I, as always, I'm going to open them up. This is the Phantom Spider. Now, this is one of my favorites. I actually broke an Abu Garcia Black Max reel with this with one of these. Um, had a giant fish. Uh, I honestly don't know how big it was. It was probably my first double-digit fish. And uh, I hooked up, got him, had him going, and uh, the spool broke and just started feeding. It was tragic. And I couldn't stop it. Tried wrapping it around with my hands, and the line didn't end up getting wrapped around a log, and it broke. But this right here... It's a very cool item. All right, so there you go, guys. That is the Phantom Spider. I mean, lots of action. Works great. You can throw it, and it works top water. And uh, it's got the real, it's got the soft body. Collapses. Very nice. Works great. Uh, it's different. You'd never think throwing a giant spider, but it works. Next, we've got a Lunker Hunt Jolt 2.5 Square Bill Crankbait Impact Series in sassy very nice that's a very nice square bill really good colors that blue with the yellow and the, man it's got it's got a good knock to it that's going to do really well here in the south that's going to be a killer nice uh third item is the yappa bug now i have not had very good luck with the yappa bug I've thrown it quite a few times, just not had very good luck with it, but that's what they sent us. It's a 2.75 inch, half ounce Yappa Bug in Roach. Ugh, ugh. Now, just like I said, this is another top water. It's got these really big splashy bugs on the front. So when you jerk it, it kind of spits the water forward, makes a lot of action, makes a lot of noise, works great. Soft body, good looking hooks. Really well made. Giant. Yeah. Uh, the next is the Lunker Hunt Poppin' Frog, and this is in bluegill. That's nice. All right, there you go. Man, those have got some crazy little Kermit the Frog looking things. I mean, those are those are nice. Got that poppin' topwater action. Got that frog action. That's nice. I have not tried one of those yet. I definitely will have to throw this. I will have access to a lake that has lots of lily pads. So I will definitely look forward to that. Okay. Next, we've got the Lunker Hunt Swim Beto. Bento. Swim Bento. Well, that's pretty nice. Got it in the clamshell. I like that. It makes it where it's going to hold its shape, especially here in Georgia. It's a nice little, nice long swim bait with a paddle tail. And that's nice. I like those colors. 
uh, the bright colors work for me. They catch me fish. Uh, especially here, I have access to big lakes and small lakes. And this is in the color is considered sassy shad. Not bad, guys. Not bad at all. Uh, next, we've got some Daiichi hooks. Looks like a couple different ones. Yeah. Not bad. Nice little worm hook. We got a worm hook. Got an offset wide gap hook. Not bad. A little three pack. I'm. I have that opinion where if you give me a soft plastic, you gotta give me a hook. Uh, next is the lunker hunt catch big fish. Basically, it's a senko. Nice. It's in pumpkin. Pumpkin with nitro tip. Very nice. That is a nice looking worm. Sankos are always good. I catch a lot of fish throwing Sankos. And last but not least, the Lunker Hunt, what do they call this? Comes with a four out wide gap hook, salt technology, but it didn't say, am I missing something? Descending Minnow. Comes with a wide gap four out hook and this nice little brown minnow. Not bad. I don't usually have a lot of luck with browns. Browns and reds I do in the springtime, but not really in the fall. But I'll give it a try. Then we got us some good stickers. We got us a nice Lunker Hunt sticker. Not bad. And we they gave us two of the Monster Bass. Oh, no, Ryan, they gave us three of the Monster Bass American Flag one. And then we got a promo code, 20% uh, off a Lunker Hunt online purchase. Nice. I won't show you that. That's fine. That's the Lunker Hunt box, guys. Put all the Lunker Hunt stuff up in the Monster Bass box. This one here it will not be recycled. We will be reusing that stuff in another way. And now we go to Six Sense. Like I said, look at this thing, guys. We could have put the Monster Bass box in this sack. It's so big. Starts off with the Clout 5.4. Not bad. Watermelon candy. Stinky. Stinky. Not bad. Nice, nice, nice little worm. I like that. Anything in watermelon, pumpkin, uh, green pumpkin, anything like that is going to do well here in Georgia. Uh, next, we have a Crush 50X. It's a 60 millimeter, 3 eighths, dives 2 to 5 feet. Uh, that is considered black magic. I've gotten a couple of these in the past, a couple big ones, and this is the smallest square bill. I will actually look forward to throwing that. Uh, next, we've got a Curve Finesse Square Build Crankbait. And, oh, this is the Backwater Blue Jay. Bluegill. Backwater bluegill. Nice. Now, last month, I was kind of disappointed that we didn't get one of these. Uh, we got a bunch of these really uh, sh sexy shad uh, colors. This is the bluegill. Man, that's cool. Look at that thing. That's a good color. For a square bill, that's going to catch fish. All right. Now, We've got a curve, 55, 3 eighths, 55, 57 millimeter dive, is, weighs 3 eighths of an ounce, and is a 5 to 9 foot deep diving crankbait. Uh, Spanish bone. Now, bone always does well for me. Bone, white. That is nice. That's a good looking bait. Man. Like I said, they always make good baits. And the last one is the Six Sense Movement 80 Wake, which is an 80 millimeter, 5 eighths ounce, uh, dives up to one foot. Nice wake bait. That's awesome. Let's look at that thing. They do so such good work on those things. And yeah, that's nice. Gotta love that. And then last but not least, the Splashback 70, 70 millimeter, 3 eighths ounce, top water popper from Six Cents. Very cool. There you go. And that is a Splashback. That is in chrome thread fin. Now, guys, that is cool. 
That is an awesome popper. I can't wait. I love that they feathered the tail. That's the tail hook. That's cool. That just, it always works. I have several that I've replaced and put those on. And that's just awesome. I cannot wait to throw that. So guys, which one would you pick? If you had to pick and spend $35, would you rather have the Monster Bass Lunker Hunt box? Or would you rather have the Sixth Sense Hard Bait box with the Clout 5.4 Watermelon Candy Trick Worms? Gotta say, um, I honestly can't comp can't pick between these two. These are both great options. I love the fact that they covered the world for Monster Bass this month with the top water for me here in Georgia. Top water is a great way to do it. I would have loved to have gotten the swim baits or the finesse baits, but that's e neither here nor there. Now, the winner of last month's giveaway was Pamela Klemp. Now, Pamela, I'm going to email. Uh, if you'll watch this, if you watch this video, comment down below and tell me if you'd rather have the bait box, the bait giveaway. The bait giveaway is going to be a six cents diving crankbait and a Lunker Hunt Ned Rig pre-rigged worm rig, or if you'd rather have the rod sleeves. Those are your choices. I will give you your, your choice. You can either have the two lures or you can have the rod sleeves. And the winner of this month, I'm going to throw something special together for that one and just along the same lines. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you guys really enjoy these videos. These are great boxes. I really think Monster Bass has really stepped up their game. Lunker Hunt's a great product. They make some great, great products. Sixth Sense is getting there because they're adding the soft plastics and really covering covering a wider spectrum. So you can throw these and catch stripers and things like that and catch different, different species of bass, not just bass. Uh, Monster Bass is geared a lot towards everything. I mean, I've caught frogs with that frog or a frog just like that frog, a big old bullfrog. So guys, thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you go over and check us out. We're on social media. We're on Facebook and on Instagram. And guys, Thank you so much for tuning in. We couldn't do this without you. We hope everybody's having a great week. Hope you guys are all staying safe during this crazy COVID craziness that's going on in our country. And guys, we pray for each and every one of you and your families that you stay safe. Hope you guys have time this week to get out there, enjoy yourself, enjoy nature, be prepared, and stay safe. God bless, guys. We'll see you soon.